Yeah. Because so, that kind of ties into to where I want to go next is being drafted or, you know, selected by the Tigers again. Now, it being your team, this is 2016, um, you know, what, what goes through your head when, what, did you get a call or did you uh, uh, hear your name be called in the well, selection? Like, how did that happen? We were actually in the playoffs in college. We were in the Super Regionals. So most colleges were done. Um, their season was over. But we were, Super Regionals is like the final 16 teams. So we were playing, we had a game that day. And there are three days to the draft, and I was pretty sure I was going to go on the second day. The second day was is from rounds three to ten, mm-hmm. so I was I was pretty sure I was going to go. I didn't know if I was going to go in the third round or the tenth round, or um, a small part of me was like, you know, unsure if I was going to go that day. But um, you know, if I had to bet, I would have bet on that day. So I was ready when I woke up that morning just to kind of field some calls and and you know talk back and forth with teams in my agent and um, I actually had to take batting practice and then we had a scouting report on the other team we were playing the University of Arizona and so it's really tough to <laughs> try and focus on a game when your your dream might come true you know and and I was pretty sure I wasn't going to come back the following year so I was like you know this might be one of my last games that I play so there's a lot of emotion going on and you really just have to uh, try and compartmentalize the situation. Um, I was I was really just thinking about the game and just okay. letting whatever was going to happen happen. And uh, that being said, we finished our scouting report in the locker room, and we were about to go to the field to warm up for the game. This is about an hour before the game, I would say. And I checked my phone, and I didn't see anything, and I was like, oh, man, like, I'm probably not going to get drafted today. And I, I was holding my phone, and uh, I got a phone call, and I didn't have the number saved, and I answered, and it was um, a Tiger scout, but I, like I said, didn't have his number saved, so I didn't know which team it was. And the guy on the other end of the phone was like, hey, uh, you ready to go? And I was like, Yeah. <laughs> That's all I said. I didn't know. And he's like, "All right, well, we picked you," and I was like, "Okay, thank you very much." And I had hung up the phone, not <laughs> knowing what team picked me. So I, I checked on Twitter because they they're pretty good with updating it. So uh, right before I went out to warm up, I was like, "Okay, it's the Tigers." So it was nice. That's amazing, dude. Yeah, it was a cool little story. And yeah, the fans um, were all following the draft too because my team had so many draft picks. They wanted to know who was going to get picked by which team so when I was warming up you know a lot of the fans were were letting me know and kind of yelling Tigers and things like that my parents got to go to that game as well so they followed um the draft that way too that's awesome that probably got you fired up a little bit too (laughs) yeah it was cool it was uh, it was uh a surreal experience for sure oh I can only imagine man that's that's unbelievable that's a cool story